So this is the unit right now. Uh, top load washer, active dual, nine kilograms. Oh, before I, I I forgot to mention about the eleven year warranty on the motor. Again, I the salesman would tell you that uh, that it has an eleven year warranty, but of course I ask around just to confirm for it, and lo and behold, there's a clause to it. There's a warranty on the motor, but they will charge you labor to change the motor in case it gets broken within those 11 years. So, yep, tip on that. Remind, you know, just make sure, well, number one, keep your invoice, uh, scan it, save it in your email and all. Anyways, let's look at how it's installed. Uh, well, of, course, you have, of course, you have to level it first. Uh, and you have the power cable here. Um, the drain, yep, it's there. Let's look at the back here. Yep, I just clamped it there. And to the drain hose right here. Oh, actually there's a drain pipe. Now, I have a complaint about the supply hose though. Uh, you see here, it's no problem, I, I, I put it here. But if you look at here, I, I changed it, okay? This is the original one. Uh, so it's a, it's a quick coupler, actually. Uh, let's see if I can take it out with one hand. Yeah, just the lock here. And, uh, well, and then you push it out. Anyways, uh, it's, it's a quick coupler. Uh, the design of this was supposed to be you're supposed to get a faucet, something like this, a round end with, without the thread, and you're supposed to clamp it there, and uh, use the the bolt to to tighten it. Uh, the problem is, uh, I installed it like that, and well, overnight, I'm not sure. Maybe our pressure here is uh, higher, but it leaked. It leaked here. And uh, the whole, the whole laundry area was was wet with water when we, we when we woke up. So uh, what I did was uh, I took the hose, uh, used a ball bulb, and uh, attached a female feeding to it. You might say, where did I get this? How did I do it? Well, well. I work in a company that specializes in fittings and hoses, so it's kind of hard to get it at the market outside. So I, I had my shop. This the hose here. It's uh, not standard. It's a uh, 716, 11, uh, 11 mm. You can't find any fittings like that, hose fittings like that. So uh, I had it made. So right now it's it's fixed there. So maybe my tip for you is if. If you don't have it's just you turn off make sure you turn off the the faucet when you're using the machine yeah I guess yeah that's it and uh, let's see how it works <laughs> 